fuck, not again. You've been tearing your hair for hours, and you don't know what to do. Just shut the fucking hell up and let the video game fag help you. Episode 1, A New Life in Hitman Blood Money. Hello, viewers, and welcome to the Angry Video Game Fag Walkthrough. Today, I'm gonna walk you through the game Hitman Blood Money. Well, not the game, just uh, the mission A New Life. That's not the mission you're seeing right now, that's just some random footage I got for no reason. But, anyway, before we start, this is a little tip from me. Angry Video Game Fag Tip Number One. I never cheat video games. That That's just bad and lame. Putting in some stupid code somewhere and getting unlimited ammo and yeah, invincibility and shit like that. That's fucking lame. But, you know, if you want to make the game a little easier and a little more fun, then there are other ways to do that. For example, a trainer. A trainer is a little program that like alters the game a bit, and it's not a cheat. But still, you get uh, invincible, and you have unlimited ammo, which fucking rocks ass! So, that's probably the first thing you should do before starting the game. Download and start the trainer. Great fun. Now let's go. First off, skip this cutscene, it's ass. And then you choose your weapons, uh, just make sure you get the gun and some upgrades for it, and then just start the level. Okay, and the guy you're supposed to kill is this, uh, Cuban guy or something. Uh, Vinny Slugger Sinistra. Yeah, great, great nickname there, buddy. Alright, you start here on this street, and, uh, the first thing you want to do is find, uh, some new clothing, so people don't know you're, uh, icky hitman with a barcode in the neck. dim dee dee dim dim also, note this van over here. It's important for later. Also, don't note this clown van. It's ass. Oh, uh, yeah, whatever. Let's speed this up a bit. Yeah, this garbage truck dude over here looks fairly innocent and you need his clothes, so uh, just pop him in the fucking head. There you go. Take his outfit and throw him in the back of the garbage truck. Yeah, I like that sound. Mm. Now, let's concentrate on that white truck van thing down the street. The FBI is in there. I got a nasty surprise for them. <laughs> now, wait a minute. Maybe you're thinking, hey, let's just open up the van and pop these motherfuckers in the head. What's going on? Eh, wrong. That's not what you're gonna do if you wanna be a cool, silent assassin like Hitman Codename 47. No, no, no. No, silent assassins play it cool. What you do is you take these donuts from the catering van that's standing outside the house. We all know cops like donuts, don't we? Yeah. So, place the donuts outside the van, knock on the door, they open, and they thank you for the donuts, then you run in and pop them in the fucking face! Now, play around with a couple of shit in there, like, uh, steal the videotape, uh, get their guns, Put on an FBI suit. Now people are going to think you're the FBI just because you're wearing sunglasses. That's wonderful. The wonders of technology and sunglasses. Hell yeah. Ah, redial the phone as well. You're like calling the guy inside the house so he gets all uh, nervy and shit. This Fuck it. Just take the donuts and leave. Now, get into the house and just uh, run around. Look like uh, the usual FBI agent with your donuts in your left hand. Walking around randomly, looking really cool and tight-assed, you know. Uh, go out in the back and you'll find the pool guy standing outside the garden shed. Those boxers look so much more comfortable than what you're wearing right now. Sneak around in a circle for a while before he goes inside the shed and just go after him and POP HIM IN THE FUCKING HEAD! Take his slim fit tank top and those nice little boxers and... Yeah, your crotch is gonna thank you later. Also, make sure you don't forget the donuts. They're utterly important. Then get the fuck out and start walking around the garden randomly for no reason. And all of a sudden, here's here's the next cliche, except for that donut cop thing. And this is the that Cuban dude's really hot wife. 
She's like, Hey, the pool's not the, the only thing that needs service. <laughs> service. <laughs> that's, that's great, you know, yeah. The hot, rich wife likes the pool guy. I mean, uh, uh, that's priceless. I mean, <laughs> yeah, just follow her around and you'll notice she walks like a fucking cripple. Ugh. This is going to take a while. You're going to follow her upstairs and, you know, she's going to walk like that the whole way. I mean, this is the hardest part of the level. This is so fucking boring. Just go ahead of her a bit. I mean, just what the hell? Hey, the fucking clown. And what the fuck is he? What? A fucking teddy bear? Here comes Yogi! No! No fucking Here teddy bears! No Yogi! fucking bears! No! Yogi! Never again! Yogi! No! Yogi! Die, you evil clown! Die! Just die, all of you! Go back to hell where you came from! No more bears! No more pain! No more! All you die! Die! Ah, oh, fuck! <laughs> you can go a long way with some motivation. <laughs> now it's mission accomplished. <sighs> Congratulations, you just completed a new life on Hitman Blood Money. Perhaps I will return with another walkthrough at some other time, but we cannot be too sure about that. But until the next time we meet, Take care of yourselves and each other. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Good night. Thanks for watching.